Well, I live right off campus in a little single wide uh, mobile home in a trailer park near campus and I had a 10 speed that I would ride right through the university down to Hollis building and park the bike there and uh, go to classes in Hollis. We shared the Hollis building with the business class. We had a small studio with a couple of black and white cameras. I'm not that old, I mean color existed, but we had black and white cameras in Hollis. And so uh, we were able to go in there, produce the, the president show um, it's called Southern Scene, I think, uh, Dr. Dale Lick, and it was a half hour interview show. And uh, so we were able to produce that and do all of our student projects. But when I go back and look at that tape now, it's black and white video on three quarter inch videotape. So uh, everything has changed since I was in the Hollis building. It's absolutely phenomenal how far we've come. Um, when we were in the Hollis building, we had this small studio with two black and white cameras. And I just got my first look at the studio in Sanford. Even though the equipment isn't there yet, that's going to be a state-of-the-art place with the very cutting-edge technology, great editing, great cameras. It's just going to be all under one roof. And finally, after all these years of uh, being a stepchild all over campus and being a nomad all over the Georgia Southern campus, communications, we're going to finally have a home all under one roof. And it's, I, can't, I can't wait to see how it looks because uh, the students are going to just have a phenomenal opportunity. And their product is going to get better and better every year. Well, when I was at Georgia Southern, uh, we just focused mainly on, uh, you know, um, print and radio and television, and uh, all those were three completely separate things. Now, with the internet, all those are all together, and students are studying multimedia journalism and computer editing. Um, we were editing tape to tape, and now, uh, of course, all of it's done on computer now, but I think the technology and the merging has um, really made it great for re um, reporters coming out of college because they can report for print, they can report for broadcast. If they work for TV or newspaper, they're going to be reporting for website. You have to be a strong print reporter, you have to be a strong broadcast reporter, and um, this program is tailored for that technology. So this Georgia Southern is a perfect fit for the technology that exists today. First of all, on being prepared, um, Georgia Southern was really strong on preparing us um, well, just to be good writers, for, for one thing. They really built a basis of being a good writer. And then um, the other most important thing Georgia Southern gave me was an internship. Um, that opened the door to my first station in Savannah, uh, my three-month internship over there. I tell people all the time, they didn't pay me anything, and I was paying tuition back on campus in Statesboro. But after three months, I treated it like a three-month job interview, and they gave me my first job in television. So my internship turned into my first job in television. And there were a lot of people um, who didn't do internships, who didn't have that foot in the door like I did. So I really credit that uh, for my, for my uh, good start in television news, is the internship and the writing skills from Georgia Southern. As far as technology goes, um, technology has changed tremendously since, uh, since I got out of uh, school. Um, I mean, we were shooting on three-quarter inch videotape on my first job. It's about that thick. And editing tape to tape. And, uh, you know, there were no computers in the newsroom. There was no Google for a quick research. You couldn't go to Facebook and ask for crowdsourcing on any stories. Um, so it really, you had to be a, a, a resourceful reporter back in the day to get your story on the air and to get all the facts right. But now, um, I mean, we, we have great reporters who are trained to come out of college and uh, use all that technology. And uh, you've got Facebook, you've got Twitter, you've got the internet. And um, I'm amazed at how quickly uh, you're able to pull a story together where it took us a good bit of the day to go out and make it happen. The technology has made the, the turnaround so much faster now. Um, it's really increased um, our deadline speed.